everybody welcome back to Genix toy box this is part two of the mail call that never ends um, so just to recap like last video you can check it out here um, we had some mega constructs figures the new ones that came out like the Roboto and the trap jaw um, and we also had for me we had a Tupac and Biggie pop gold collection and then we had a Wuzzle trash can um, so yeah I would definitely check out that video to kind of get up to speed but I've got some more stuff here. I got stuff there. I got stuff there. And again, a big bad toy store box over there. So we'll get there little by little. Um, like I said, it's the mail call that never ends. But it's, it's exciting. And he must have been clicking a lot of buttons. And I didn't see any of this stuff come in. And I said it last video. Um, oh, okay. I know what this is. Um, so I, I didn't see any of this come in. All of a sudden, I just saw boxes accumulating in the He-Man room and had no idea where they were coming from. Um, it just seemed like they were multiplying by themselves, but come to find out, he's been finding some really good stuff online. Okay, so we've got a Battle Beast weapon, so that's good. I'm like, it's purple. I like it. All right, let me see if I can unwrap him. It's taking forever. What is this? Oh, it's a duck. Interesting. I like it. It's a scuba duck. Like, why would he need scuba gear? He's a duck. I was seeing if his rub worked, and it does. He is a fire duck. That makes sense. He can go. It should work, his little thingy. And then you got his weapon, which I'm not going to put in his hand because I'm not trying to break it. Um, so, yes, we are almost done. Almost done, Battle Beasts. Um, who knows at this point? Um, but we're making good headway. And, you know, now my son's collecting as well, so we'll see how that goes. Um, but yeah, that's a cute one. I like the scuba diving duck. All right. Got another bag here. Let's see what's in this one. I'm like, what am I going to... I look like a bug. That's why I had a heart attack. Um, it looks weird, but I think it's okay. I'm fighting with the kid's scissors again. What is this? can't win. I'm trying to be like super careful too. Okay. Some weapons, random weapon lot, I'm guessing. Um, I know my husband won an online auction well, not that long ago was a random weapon lot, but I mean, it's a pretty nice, cute. I see some GI Joe stuff in here, which is nice. Like this helmet looks very familiar. This is a chest plate. Check that out. I like that a lot. Um, this is from, um, what is this? This helmet looks like it's from the Masters Universe, the, um, the New Adventures. That's kind of what it looks like. I'm not going to lie to you. And then a random chest piece, but that's cool. Um, I like random lots of weapons. And then I'll probably do my research, find out what they go to. But if you saw anything recognizable, put it in the comments below. It'll save me um, some time to look it up. So that'd be great. All right, let's see. We've got another box. These were kind of left over from, um, I don't know if you saw our Instagram live for October. Um, I started doing a bit of a mail call um, and then, you know, got into the toy talk. And before you know it, time was up. So this is kind of like the remnants of that mail call. Um, so I haven't really touched it since then. So we'll see what's in here. Some really cool stuff, I hope. Like, this came from Target. That can only mean one thing. It's either Pops or Masters of the Universe. Or Reese's, because my husband's weird. Um, Reese's, take fives. Really? He went and got the Gujitsu. I told him, I was like, he doesn't even play with these anymore. But he wanted the Cthulhu Gujitsu. That was a mouthful to say. Cthulhu Gujitsu. I don't know if you guys saw, but they actually have a Gujitsu cartoon. Um, they make this guy look to be a lot bigger than he is, but he's weird. These things are creepy. Oh, this is why he told me to put it back. I found this in the store, and he said, no, I don't want it. And I'm like... Is he sick? Is he ill? Um, apparently, it's because he already had one coming. 
All right, thank goodness. Um, so this speaker was very cool in the cartoon. I really liked it a lot. Um, so it's really cool looking. I like it a lot. Um, and it was really interesting because by what I understand, if you are trying to nab one of these things, they are actually $20 online, which is about like $14 less than the in-store price. And I believe Target price matches their online prices. Um, so I would definitely take a look, see if you can snap one of these online. Um, I wound up, like I said, seeing two of these on the shelf. And then I think these are all the ones that we need to collect. I love how we said, we're not getting any of these lies. The only one we don't have is Battle Cat have them all um so this is really cool i love the whole like half metallic half not and i love how he comes with a metallic face and just like a regular evil face with glowing red eyeballs very nice and we've got um some extra hands which you know my feelings on extra hands um but it is very cool i like this piece a lot very nice i'm glad he got it so um and then my son got a jujitsu that's the thing. I mean, he was really into them for a long time and then just wasn't. So I don't know. He, he you know how kids are. They like switch from phase to phase. And my husband's that way too. I'm not going to lie to you. He'll switch from like Masters of the Universe to like Battle Beasts to like G.I. Joe and a heartbeat and like TMNT. Like I, he just likes toys and I guess so does my husband. Can you blame them? Toys are pretty awesome. Toys are an all good. Um, it definitely brings you back to that happiness that you had as a child and, you know, the stuff you used to play with and the good old memories. All right, let's see what we've got here. Oh, okay. All right. Why do I feel like he has this though? We'll see what it, we'll, we'll see. So we have, if I can get these out of the thing, there we go. Leech, oh my goodness. The, his face is so insane, by the way. Um, like, I would love if this actually worked. I'm not going to lie. I would love if it could squirt water. But I love how ridiculous and asinine it looks as compared to, you know, the, the action figure that just looks as crazy. Um, so I actually don't think he has this one. I thought he did for some reason. Maybe I was just hoping he did. Um, but now he does. It's very cool. I like it a lot. So there we go. Like I said, I would love to see if that thing squirt water, but, and see my box tower over here is growing of like my older boxes. All right, so we have a Walmart and a this one. I don't know what this one is. We're gonna do this one and we'll do the Walmart box. Um, and then, well, maybe we'll just do this one and then we'll see, save the Walmart box for later because it's most likely Master of the Universe. I mean, I'm guessing, right? Um, this has a lot of heat on it. So this is going to take me a minute. Like, I'm, I'm going to have to stab this a couple times. Oh my goodness. I wonder if the person watches the channel and knows I hate tape a lot. All right, let's see. Like I said, it's going to take me a bit. But I think I've got it. Maybe. Okay. Okay. Oh, this was my fault. I bought these online because I saw, we saw them once, once in Target, um, once. And I've never seen them again. I, and it was like a random one in Greensboro. Um, so I found them online. They were a really good price online. Um, and so I got them. So we have the, no, I don't even think we have the entire set, to be honest with you. Um, I know we don't have Bumblebee, and I know we don't have Megatron, I mean, um, Optimus. I think we have a Soundwave, I think we have a Starscream, and I think we have these two, but these are doubles. Um, but we definitely needed to have them. They're really cool. Oh, of course, Starscream's a variant. Okay, that's fantastic. Um, but yeah, the, these are really cute. They're really like displayable figures they connect to make a battle scene so it's really cool love them a lot um but yeah i found them once in a target and have not found them again um so i'm kind of glad i found these guys online all right so i'm gonna wrap up the video stay tuned for part three or, yeah and we're not even i think we're halfway we might be halfway all right stay tuned i'll be right back bye guys hello there 
I am so grateful that we have reached another milestone. I love doing these videos. It means that you guys are watching and subscribing. So thank you so much. It really means a lot to me. Um, so we have to set a new goal. And I think I'm gonna go big at 1,000 subscribers. And we're pretty close. So please, everybody, continue to spread the word. Share on your social media pages. Get your friends and family together. Um, Anybody you may know that may like toys or anyone that just likes YouTube. Um, so spread the word. I would love to get a thousand subscribers and then we can do another giveaway. Don't know what it's going to be yet. Um, maybe some suggestions. What would you think? What would you like to see? What would you like to see as far as a giveaway? Um, do you want to do like a toy, a tour, a toy and a tour? Just curious. Um, but again, thank you guys so much for the support. And this has been a really great journey. So let's make it to 1000. We can do it. Thanks, guys. Bye.